Hey guys, how is everyone doing? Guys, uh, in today's video, I want to show you the loom from this uh, Pelagos LHD that I actually have done unboxing, um, you know, quite a while ago. So I've owned this watch for about uh, more than one month, definitely. I forget exactly when, but I did unbox a video, guys. So if you haven't checked out my video when I unboxed this uh, Tudor Pelagos LHD, you can go ahead and check it out in my channel. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, guys, please go ahead and subscribe uh, so that you can get an update instantly whenever I upload a new video into this channel. Guys, um, this watch is very, very beautiful, okay? Uh, and one of, the, one of the things that stands out uh, from this watch is that uh, this watch has an amazing, amazing loom. Uh, it's one of the if if it's one of the best, if not, I would say the best. I can confidently say it is the best. Uh, I have, uh, I have had uh, experience with uh, quite a uh, quite a lot of watches, uh, and you know I read a lot uh, from online, and nothing uh, in my. Uh, in my experience that have beat uh, this watch in terms of loom so in this uh, in this video today I want to show you how bright it is the loom of this Tudor Pelagos it is just amazing it's ridiculous so let's charge up this bad, bad boy and I will show you the the, the loom the loom shot uh, of this uh, of this Pelagos LHD it's just an amazing uh, amazing uh, watch in terms of uh, loom okay just a second all right guys look at this this is this is how crazy it is i mean the loom as you can see is just so bright and crisp it is insane okay it is insanity i i think i think the only watch that can really compete with this palagos is uh you know like panerai i heard i heard panerai um they also have uh, uh, Panerai's, they, they also have a very, very good loom, uh, you know, but I, I, I've never had Panerai in my life, so I, I cannot really tell. Uh, but yeah, but I heard that, they, you know, it has a very, very outstanding loom. Uh, and then besides that, I also have another watch that I really want to show you uh, that I think I can compare with uh, Pelagos in terms of loom uh, brightness. But still, uh, you know, I don't think that uh, it really uh, comes close. I mean, well, uh, well, it, it it comes close, but but still, I still feel Palagos is still better. And I do have another watch, and guess which one is this, guys? This is the uh, Blanc Pond 50 Fathoms. Okay, I haven't done any video yet uh, on this watch. Uh, this is my grill watch. I have, I have. Um, yeah, I have just acquired this watch and I'm still blown away, okay, by the beauty of this watch. And But anyway, I'm going to do a, a review of this Blanc Pond. Uh, I will do unboxing, but today I want to compare the loom shot of this Blanc Pond 50 Fathoms and the Pelagos, okay. So as you can see, uh, the Blanc Pond uh, can really go head to head with uh, Pelagos. Okay, let me let me charge up the Pelagos because, um, because it's still lacking uh the 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 charge here let me see so the palagos uh, in my opinion is just a lot brighter uh, a lot sharper than than blanc pond okay so as you can see uh they can really go head to head uh, you know they can really go toe to toe uh i think they are uh almost equally as strong as each other but i still feel palagos is just better okay because uh it's just sharper and i really love the loom of this palagos because uh it is blue blue color uh, whereas the blanc pond is green color so they have different color but the the uh, Pelagos, I feel that um, it has an edge, okay, when it comes to Blanc Pond. Uh, because I feel that uh, the Pelagos, the contrast of the loom is just, let me let me charge it up, uh, charge it up uh, even more. Uh, the the, the Pelagos loom, in my opinion, is just, it's just very, very contrasted. The contrast is just insane, okay. The Panerai's, um, a lot of Panerai's that I know, uh, the loom, uh, the loom color of, of Panerai's are uh, pretty much blue, like Blanc Pond Fifth Fathoms, because uh, at the end of the day, uh, they're all a diverse watch, right? So, you know, diverse watch, normally they have a, a green loom color, but for Pelagos, it's quite uh, unique because it's a modern piece. Uh, so Rolex or Tudor uh, basically put the blue loom, which I really, really enjoy. Uh, I like blue loom uh, compared to um, uh, better than the green loom. And yeah, as you can see, they're, they're both uh, almost equally bright. Uh, 
you know but i but i think if i have to pick favorite if i have to pick the winner the pelagos i think is the winner of this uh of this battle okay uh so even though bomb puffet phantoms is also one of the best uh in the market in terms of loom strength but i think uh pelagos has an edge uh in this battle guys so yeah just i just i just want to show you like you know how it compares to bomb puffet phantoms because uh, because i don't see any other videos out there that that has you know there are a lot of videos out there that shows you know how good the loom of pelagos but they never really show like comparison they never show comparison of pelagos against other watches you know, like panrai or blah blah with phantoms uh, but here in this video since i don't have panrai i can show you like what i have i have blah blah with phantoms and i compare between the two and i can say that the pelagos wins this battle so guys uh today's video i just want to show you the loom uh and then uh, i'm gonna do a review after this uh so stay tuned and guys uh, this is the end of my video today i uh, really hope you enjoy i really hope you like it please go ahead and subscribe again if you can thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoy this video bye bye